All right, today we are going to uh, go into this uh, hell, go into this uh, shrine that looks like hell on earth and take care of the big bad, most likely. This. But look! It looks completely different from how it was two months ago. Really? That's right. The spirit veins have been activated. It likely has something to do with the rivalries. Well, only way to find out is to keep going. Now... This is the very short way though, I love it, remember. So it most definitely will just be one single big bad. That's the head. Their CP is not enough. So get a uh, switch, la, switch uh, this. Switch them all. I need a uh, box here. Give us box. Who else? Could be Sava. Yes, Sava. Why the hell so are you doing this then here like that? Like freaking want to like just want to look stylish or something. Freaking. Oh, you guys showed up a lot faster than I expected. They are freaking so off. Uh, Dupli will be one of the wolf soon, and Cole will be uh he will be uh used as a. Uh, Fundi. Not fast enough, though. Time's not really on our side here. Crow? You're here after all. He made it plenty clear that we didn't have a choice in the matter. Well, he did not die, so at that, he's at least something. That said, it's good to see you again. You too, Duvali. Thanks for taking the time to meet with us. Well, what's with the casual hello? We are not friends. Your thanks is nothing more than a pittance to me. <coughs> Freaking push her into the fucking ground. But she is being uh, freaking uh, uh, an idiot. Personally, I'd rather not have to see this sordid scene play itself out. But this is the path I've chosen. Sordid scene? 
What does she mean by that? Hmm. Well, now that we've got both Class Sevens all nice and gathered here, I'll tell you everything I know about the rivalries. Uh, already? No warm-up monologue or anything? I'm just glad we're able to get straight to the heart of the matter for once. Can we get to a freaking tongue and talk there over tea? Why stand here and, and talk about this? Alright then. I'm all ears. Tell me what you know about this tension within me. Within us. I feel it in the air. In the world itself. I feel my heart racing, stealing itself for some inevitable clash it awaits. The world itself? I see. So that's how it works. Huh, sounds like the little lady's got it all figured out. I get the feeling Gaius, Sarah, Emma, and Miss Kitty over there are on the right track too. Simply put, the rivalries are a struggle for power. Bullshit. Death matches between divine knights. As the world is driven to the brink of annihilation. <sighs> That's madness. I knew it. I saw the parallels with what Vita attempted at the Infernal Castle two years ago. Her goal was to trigger a pseudo-rivalry, wasn't it? Then there's the experiments Ouroboros conducted with the three Ions over the course of the past year. They were trying to see if the rivalries could be artificially reproduced, is that right? Yes. I was never privy to the particulars, but... They were seeking to awaken the tremendous power brought forth by the fusion of the two Septarians. The experiments were a means to that end. A bid to turn melees into miracles. That more or less covers it. Vita's been searching for ages for a way to keep the curse in check. The curse of the Great One. The catalyst of the Great Twilight that ushers in the end of the world. All those clashes between the Divine Knights in the past have just been dress rehearsals at best. As Orbal technology advanced, the day soon came when humanity's weapons were powerful enough to conceivably cause the end of the world. Uh, yes, hello. Uh, uh, no, I, I, I won't perform any abortions today. Uh, I, you will have to give birth. Bye. <clears throat> and with that, the conditions to begin the rivalry of the Seven were met. I don't think I have ever uh, 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 talked about this, but I'm actually also a doc doctor as well. You can't be serious. So it's not that the rivalries are the cause of the world ending. It's that the rivalries can only occur as the world's being ravaged by war. And perhaps it'd help to see the world as a sort of crucible. The Great Twilight is the kindling, and war, the bellows that stoke its infernal flame. The freaking like, uh, there's always calls coming in when I'm in the middle of freaking playing a video game for relaxation. <clears throat> When I want to see a patient, I will uh, personally call, not the other way around. The further the extent of its strife, the hotter the blaze. As the crucible drowns in fire, the seven, who were once one, begin their battle within. From there they fight to the death, melting into each other amongst the flames, one by one. Until finally, the seven are reforged into a whole once more. C come again? <coughs> it's somewhat akin to the practices of the alchemists of old, distilling materials into their purest form. It sounds more to me like a survival of the fittest, a battle royale with one singular victor. It's both, but on a far larger, far more primal scale than anything we've ever known. Well, shit. <coughs> Seems like this is ringing some bells for you. No surprise there. You're an awakener and a sacrifice. 
a two-for-one package. You know exactly what it is we have to do. We can feel it in our bones. So you mean... You're starting the rivalry right here? Right now? So wh why are we starting to... Oh, I don't get this game stuff. <laughs> I'm no Vita, but I know a prime opportunity when I see one. But it is cool, I guess. The war hasn't started yet. Maybe if we get a jump on this, we can derail the gnome's plans. But the second the Empire launches its attack on the Republic... As the sacrifice, I'd be forced to engage in the rivalries. Whether I like it or not, that's all there is to it, right? Reen, the curse would take over. <laughs> Nail on the head. You'd either go berserk, or your memories would get sealed away, turning you into a mindless puppet. It's one side of the coin, or the other. <sighs> then now may be the last chance I have, before my memories are snatched away. Before I'm forced to duel to the death, devoid of all sense and reason. I can still see this rivalry through with my own eyes. Triumph or fail by my own merit. I stand before you, Crow, as a swordsman of the Eight Leaves and a member of Class Seven. Even if it's the last thing I ever do, I'll do so as myself. Reen Schwarzer. Instructor Reen. <laughs> ah, there you go. Before we begin, the stage must be set, as with the Infernal Castle and Ouroboros' experiments. Appoint three allies to assist you. Only then shall we take you on. <coughs> Only three. Uh, all of them. So she can do it even without the Star Ritter. The Radiant Star Formation. Huh. Guess this is as good a stage as we're gonna get. We don't quite meet the full requirements, but hey, a passing grade's a passing grade. All right then, this will be our last dance, Reen. I saved it just for this moment, just for you in the throes of the fading twilight. <laughs> I'm ready. Let's do this, guys. Right. Who to put there? Well, I already actually picked. Don't know why the head. Yeah, the, uh, I simply to pick again. Games and uh, who else? Wait, Nawa is not one of them. Sawa and uh, Marcus. Apparently the walkthrough is suggesting that I uh, take Yosis along because of his uh, 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 ability that he has. But he's not getting close to it. With all you've got, holding back won't grant you mercy. <laughs> won't let you. That is funny. <laughs> Strike! You're wide open. I'm up. Skin. Yeah. Full X-ray skin. External warrior. And now I'm moving there. The lights. Leave it to me. Stop. 
Leave it to me. This one. This one will will defend against Divine a certain shield. spell. Protect us! You won't escape! I'm up! This one. Yeah! I'm up! My mind is clear. It's my turn. This is it! You failed your inspection! One more! This is the end! Justice is bullet! I'm far from finished. Let's go. And I'm just getting started. This is the pebble in the sea. Need my spear. I'll wait, heavens! Very well. Almost dead. Race! Lightning light! Iowa's saber! Is that really all you got? Time to kick things up a notch! I won't let you! Here we go! Ah! Shoulder the cross across! Rebellion! <laughs> Let's go! Crimson Slash! Ready! <laughs> Let's go! Very well. Let's go. Raging fire formation. It's my turn. How do you like this? Awaken! Oh, oh, what the? I'm up! Ha! You have my thing. Let's go. I appreciate it. Judgment time! With this! I'm up! Yeah! I'm up! Crap! Leave it to me! Inkly. Ha! You want it's me to thank turn. you? Is the pebble in sea? My spear. I'll wait, heavens! Leave it to me. Ah! I didn't leave it to me. They're open. Take this. It's my turn. Get back. Almost there. This glow. The stage is set. The preparations are complete. This is as much as I can help. The rest is up to you two. Right. We're up, Ordine. Understood, Pro. Foul 
Shalimar! Heed my call! Fight with you, but you try. Instructor Reen, Milliam. Oh yeah, he saw his building. Short stack, still glowing red, huh? But whatever, that sword ain't that much stronger than one made out of Zemurian ore. Don't hold back, Reen. Come at me with all you've got. Huh? Hey, you in there or what? Uh, of course. Crow. If a rivalry is, at its core, a battle between Divine Knights, then what about the Awakeners? <sighs> Since I'm also a sacrifice, I don't know what will happen to me. But you're only being kept alive as an Awakener by the curse. So what'll happen if you, an immortal, were to lose? Wait. Doesn't that mean he'd... <sighs> well, guess that's what we're here to find out, huh? Gonna have to call you out for acting like you already won, though. You gotta kick things off first. <laughs> so come on. You better be ready for this, Reen. The world's about to crumble right under your feet. So quit screwing around. Your pathetic opponent's already dead. So put him out of his damn misery. <clears throat> Fine. But let me make just one thing clear to you. You're not pathetic. You're our friend. A fellow member of Class 7. A rival whose shadow I've long struggled to emerge from. That's all I have to say. Now let's settle this! Ha! <laughs> Fine by me. Show me what you've got, Reen! Yes! Yeah, beat both this. Awesome. That was awesome. That was awesome. Depending on okay, a good a six partner is a Tina according to the walkthrough. Oh, I, I'm using the walkthrough from Deal Seeker. So in that case, I better have a Tina to a six. Tina is like freaking negative two hundred strength. How's the good? She can cast a with fat barrier that protests against all attacks. All right, right, that is good. I also want to check. Okay, want to want to check this uh this thing, power, defense, and okay, everything's perfect. All right, let's settle this once and for all. If the game is going to take, okay, let's do this. It's going to have Rex fight all the fucking it's all it's the bad bad choice. That would be epic. Uh, that the game's fully redeemed in that way. Yeah. Over here. 
<laughs> that was useless. That was so important. 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 The dark pit. Dark pit. Dark pit. It's important. You know, afterwards. What the heck? Spirit! My turn. EP, I did EP. No, this will restore EP. I'll support you. Shoot her down. You want to? It's my turn. There, come in now. Yeah, over here. It's my turn. Now. Yeah. Shoot up. <laughs> Not bad. Whoa. Come at me, Breen. It's my turn. I'll take you on. Spirit. I shall go. I'll support you. Over here. Yeah. They're down. Shoulder the cross on. <laughs> You're finished. <laughs> it's my turn. Get up. Get down. And open it. My turn. Yeah! It's my turn! Dean. <laughs> Recharge! Darkness! Suck again! Yeah! Yeah! Over here! Let's go! Spirit! Shoot him down! You're wide open! I'm up! Get him back! Oh, it's it's my, my turn! I'll support you! Get up yeah. there! You're wide open! My turn! Uh, yeah! Let's go! There! Oh, in the darkness! Something king! My turn. Ha! I'm up! There! Oh, shit! Guess this is it. We'll keep going for a brighter tomorrow. This mean the rivalry's complete? Yeah, looks like our little improv routine did the trick. What the? It's just as I feared. I don't understand. Your wounds aren't fatal like they were in the Infernal Castle. Yeah, you've made it through way worse than this. Stay with us, Crow! Well, here's your answer. Ordine's power is Valimar's now. And with it, whatever it was that kept me alive, each successive rivalry will lead you to the root of this curse. Not another but word. You must conserve your strength. I want to pilot Sameen, that. Help me! We can't leave him like this. I'm with you. <laughs> you some think uh, I'd bitch. be used to this by now. I guess karma really is a bitch. At least this time, our power can live on through you. Sorry for making you guys go through this a second time. Long as Reen's got you guys on his side, 
I know he'll be all right. Just do me a solid and bring Jellica back to her senses for me. Ooh, okay, he's still coughing. Like hell, you've played enough hooky for two lifetimes as it is. And what about Toa? Or George? They deserve that closure just as much as you. You guys managed to bring Reen back from the brink. That's no small feat. Guy's a real drama queen, though. Take it from me. Second he starts acting all spoiled and mopey, you pull him right back out, okay? Stop talking like that! You can't just give up! Don't you understand how much you mean to him? You're the only one acting spoiled here, Crow. I Instructor Reen. Hey, what do you think you're... Pull yourself together, Crow Armbrust. The world is about to crumble. Not just beneath my feet, but yours as well. Are you really just going to take the easy way out? Now of all times? Huh. What the? How are you? Look, Valimar, he's... Stopped absorbing Ordeen's power? That's not it. He's reversing the flow. <gasps> Inconceivable. Screw the rivalry. I won't do this to you. I won't be responsible for your death. You're going to live, damn it. You hear me? You're going to fight, and struggle, and survive, no matter what it takes. I won't let you off the hook that easily. You've got a ton of interest to pay back. They're coming back! It's as though something's happening between them. Yes, perhaps it's... Come back to us, Crow! I need you. We all need you! Exactamundo! We're no quitters, right, Crow? That voice. <clears throat> I see. So, all this time. Pink to beat her is like freaking. <laughs> oh, it's freaking broken. <laughs> Pink to meet her. <clears throat> What's that noise? It sounds like waves. I thought we were way down in the soul shrine. Your orb is now uh, taken uh, by to uh, some. In other dimension by a uh, medium, most likely for a uh, certain vocation. Hey, rise and shine, princess. Uh. Uh, give me a break. How many times is he gonna put us through this? For once, I agree. What will we do with him? Oh, did, okay, they pulled him uh, out of. The beach move, maybe. I believe I now understand what it Pulled means to me. feel frustrated. <laughs> Guess you'll just have to take it out on him sometime. <laughs> Don't you lot ever take anything seriously? <sighs> okay, the not touch. Oh, I remember this place. Well, I should hope so. This is the Lodge on Brionia Island. We brought you here so you could rest a bit. Oh, sure. It's only been like six friggin' hours. You done with your little beauty sleep yet, or what? I don't need any rest. I was pretending to be a snip. To be a snip. Try to take it easy on him. You'd be tired too if you went all out the way he did. Though we do need to start planning for the rivalries to come at some point. <sighs> right. The rivalry. What happened after? Oh. Hey there, Duvali. Excuse me? That's Duvali the Swift to you. I thought you freaking quick the 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 the, 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 the swept or something, so that title doesn't apply to you anymore. 
or maybe is that her birth title or something? I get the feeling you've become a bit too accustomed to my presence. Uh, you will soon uh, be very accustomed in the freaking Vex is basically a freaking on style, on style or, you know. What's her name? I forgot what her name is. That red hair woman. Vex is more like, more, uh, it's not that woman on style, their voice. <clears throat> Sorry, I was just surprised, is all. <laughs> Hey, how's it going? I woke up just a little bit ago, but I can't really move much either. Honestly, I could have used a few more hours in Dreamland. Crow, then everything worked out okay. Looks that way. Just couldn't let me have my big moment, could you? And it's good he didn't. It would have been your last otherwise. Emma, Celine, what exactly happened back there? No, no card style in this freaking game series now. The game is the game scripts once it that way. I can only make a guess based on the flow of mana, but I believe Valimar has made Ordeen into a servant of sorts. Look at that, also was Alcoli, a servant. Oh, uh. <clears throat> the works we need a lot of servants. So, like what the Dark Dragon did to those Calvardians? He's like night touched, but with a K. Not quite. Those soldiers were nothing more than slaves to their master's will. In this case, it's more of a matter of kinship, of sharing a spiritual link, like the one Emma and I have. I see. So it's like my connection with Clown Soleus. Then the two divine knights have become lord and retainer in a certain sense. It must have extended to the Awakeners, too. Otherwise, Crow would have disappeared by now. <laughs> As rivalries go, this one wasn't exactly by the book. Ordeen's still here, for one. Valimar didn't absorb his power. Well, sounds like a pretty good deal to me. Well, it is. I mean, now we're up a man and a divine knight. Your dad is ready to... Well, that just works chats this night. So freaking wise in his decisions in my decisions i am basically he the him but i basically because he grow up in that world his personal uh his uh, style is a bit different <coughs> agreed ordeen will be a welcome addition to our forces and with crow now in our ranks as well it will make a world of difference oh counting me in already huh well no use arguing about it to the victor goes the spoils. Besides, until we manage to put this great twilight business to an end, I'm living on borrowed time. Crow. <laughs> then your ultimate fate remains unchanged. Yep, any way you slice it, my being here contradicts reality itself. Doesn't matter what you, Adios, or anyone else has to say about it. My fate's not gonna change one bit. Am I right, Gaius? Emma? Unfortunately so. As much as we hate to admit it. Crow. <sighs> so what? We're supposed to just let it happen? There has to be something we can do. Yuna. Altina. T screw Adios, then. What's she even good for? <clears throat> we can worry about that later. Because right here... Right now, you're still alive. I won't accept this fate of yours as a hard and fast truth. As long as you're still here, I'm not giving up on you. But for now, I'm just happy you're back with Class 7. Back where you belong. <laughs> <laughs> That's right. I swear, you're all just as sentimental as ever. Welcome back, Crow. You're one of us again. So, let's give it all we've got. Just the way we always have. <laughs> ah, screw it. 
I gotta pay all that interest back one way or another, right? But there's a lot of <laughs> interest up on interest. No. Utility. <laughs> and also need more servants. <laughs> About time. <laughs> Seems our lost little lamb has found his way back to the flock. <sighs> Honestly, I am in awe of how much time you lot fritter away on sentimentality. And what of you then? What do you intend to do from here on? Zhong. What I intend to do is none of your concern. Zhong, the the hem, the waff group. <coughs> How the heck do you even say that word? Half him. I will have to look this up. Wait a second. Here, here. Oh, dance. Here, Zhong the here. This is as far as my charity goes. Come tomorrow, I'll be going bye bye. Uh, no, no. <laughs> bye bye. You need a vax permission. So where are you going then? Can't really do much anymore without the society backing you up, right? <laughs> you did mention something about getting to the bottom of Ouroboros' plans. You've got some other allies to fall back on, I take it. Do you even have a plan to get off this island to begin with? I'm not too familiar with it, but the society does employ some form of teleportation technique, as I recall. But she's no longer part of the society, correct? Well, I, uh, if it came down to it, I could simply swim back to Ordis. Yes, that's right. <laughs> that's not going to work. Your chance of survival caps out at zero percent. I'm pretty sure swimming to Ordis is uh, farther than from uh, Florida to 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 an island uh, the south of Florida. <clears throat> You know which I do. <laughs> Looks like the Swift's been stopped cold. I guess you can only use their teleportation when you're actively working with them, huh? I Listen, Duvali. I get it. I know things might seem a little weird given all the history between you guys, but things are different now. So how about you and I take a load off? Let someone else take the reins for a change. Excuse me? I think that fight must have addled your brains. What kind of fool do you take me for? I am, or was, a proud member of the Stall Ritter. The very idea is utterly ridiculous. Maybe so. We do still owe you for backing us up at the Black Workshop. Not to mention the help you've given us here on Brionia. We couldn't have completed the rivalry without you. Our paths have crossed so often. At this point, it can only be fate. But you may consider it just a temporary arrangement, if you'd like. At least until you figure things out for your own. In addition, your lord will surely be involved in the rivalries we will face in the near future. Coming along with us could yield quite a wealth of information about her, don't you think? Well, well my lord is most certainly. I suppose were I to play my cards right. <sighs> she always knows just what buttons to push, huh? This girl's one to watch out for. And Lucy's really smart. <laughs> this is nothing compared to the way she organized the Viceland army. <laughs> oh yeah, Muse's got playing people down to an art. Ahem, if we could get back to the matter at hand. I have decided to help you out a bit. For now. But remember this, Class 7. We are not friends. Our cooperation is one of convenience and nothing more. 
是不知道什么在里面。So c u 好，这里我们 end the video here. Okay. It's been long enough that cousins.